Hello my YouTube subscribers, I'm here with another e-liquid review, and if I got my count right, hopefully I do, don't don't kill me if I didn't, we're going to be reviewing uh, Sweet Tooth from Alpha Vape, and I'm pretty much oblivious to what this is. I have done very little with this uh, flavor other than uh, open it up and smell it once, maybe twice, I think once when I opened up the Zampa box. Um... I love glass bottles. They're really expensive though and I don't always buy them anymore, but I save every glass bottle I get. I love the glass bottles. I love the little eyedropper that comes in with the glass bottles. Um, I think those are great. Um, you know, this fluid kind of looks pretty dense looking at it. It's got an orange, orange color to it. No idea what the flavor is. Um, let's go ahead and... Uh, open it up. Now it's 18 milligrams and the bottle is completely transparent. The e-liquid is uh, it's mostly orange. Now if you ask me it has a caramel flavor to it. Um, a bit of a, a caramel and uh, maybe some graham. I really think I'm smelling a huge, huge amount of caramel flavor. I'm just going to leave this in here because I'm going to pull it from the bottle here. I got my uh, Aga T2 cleaned out and I am, I water cleaned it and then I dry ran it a little bit so that the uh, wick should be mostly dry. Looking at the density of this, you can see it's, it's pretty thick. Um, I'm betting it's going to be around 50-50. Uh, PG VG mix. It is 18 uh, 18 milligrams of nicotine. So it is going to be a little heavy for me personally. That's got a really good caramel flavor. I want to say caramel. We'll look at the description after I get like a first impression of what's going on here. I think that should be enough. We got it uh, mostly full. Let's prime the wicks though. I have not recorded a video in a while because I have been vaping on all these other flavors that I had laying around. So I finished off the Blackbird, I finished off the Apple Rings, I finished off um, the Grappler. Um, I still got some of that peach cobbler, root beer, and graham cracker left because I, I really enjoyed those and I, I want to vape them, but I want to save them because they were so good. Well, maybe not the peach cobbler so much, but the root beer and the graham cracker. Let's go ahead and take a toot on this and see how it tastes. Throat hit. It's got some throat hit to it. Vapor production is good. There we go. Um Man, that 18 milligrams of nicotine. I wish, I wish they didn't provide me with 18 milligrams of nicotine. It really makes my uh, my tongue just like numb, and uh, I just have a hard time handling that much nicotine. Um, it's it's really sweet flavor. I wanna. Uh, I'm doing kind of a guessing game with myself today. I haven't looked at the description at all. I don't know what I'm vaping, but I want to go. Th go through what I'm tasting and then we'll read the description and uh, we'll just see just how close I am to what the description says. Um, so it's got a nice caramel flavor to it. It's really good. And I want to say like a, a graham cracker or maybe a, a 
cinnamon bun or caramel roll flavor to it. Mmm. Mmm, that's good. That is really good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm not an ultra fan of uh, really sweet uh, vapes. Mmm. Almost like a, a French toast flavor. So I'm, I think I'm hitting on some cinnamon notes there. Oh yeah, and it vapes really good. I got my fan running. You can see the vapor just flowing that way. Because even though it's spring, and I got my fan to take all the cool air up, it's blizzarding today. This is really good. I'm enjoying this. I'm not a, a big fan of really sweet flavors. You know, I, I, don't, I don't enjoy them as much as I enjoy fruity flavors, but I, I like them uh, when they're really, really good, and I think this one is really good. And I think right now, if I were to do this, uh, my favorite uh, examples, this would be number one right here. Maybe that's because I like really good caramel vapes. Um, so I'm, I'm guessing like a sticky bun almost. It's, it's got a nice caramel flavor to it. What I'm going to do here now is open up the Firefox. And let's see, it's Alpha Vapes. Alpha Vapes. Let's see. There we go. Sweet. No, I'm spelling it wrong. Yeah. Google found it for me. Sweet Tooth. Elevated Vaping. Alpha Vape. Let's see what they say. This is a good flavor. I like this. I'm going to vape on it some more while we, while we wait. I'm 18. Uh, pretty self-explanatory, right? A creamy mix of vanillas with cookies and graham cracker. Is he all, oh, vanilla, vanilla wafer is the ultimate mix for those who like dunking their cookies in their milk. Looking for a sweetness to brighten a hard day? Look no further. Sweet Tooth is, is an amazingly crafted juice where all of the flavors are blended in a unique, yet once again, sweet way. Stuff has been a huge hit, and it is no surprise. This juice will rock your taste buds. You know, I think it does. And now that they, now that now that it says uh, vanillas with cookies and graham cracker, I knew I was tasting graham cracker. At least they said that. Um, I th I still think I'm getting a, a caramely flavor, but definitely I can definitely taste the the vanilla wafer tones, or at least the vanilla tone in there. It doesn't say caramel, so maybe maybe I'm just making that flavor up in my mind. But I I personally think like I'm tasting like a nice, uh, you know those uh, Girl Scout cookies that have like a caramel bottom and then coconut. It tastes like that to me. Yeah, this is delicious. This is fantastic. I'm so glad I have this. I have a huge bottle of it. Looks like it's oh man, about 15. No, uh, I don't know. Yeah, it's about 15 milliliters. I would say. Comes in a nice glass bottle. I love this glass bottle right here. Let's see if you can get a nice look at it. Focus, focus. I don't think it's focusing very well. Oh, I hate it when it doesn't focus. Screw you, camera. So that's the bottle. Love this flavor, man. Absolutely love this flavor right now. I'm going to vape on this all day. For me, I can see this being an all-day vape. Um, would I come back and buy this? You know, I want to say yes, I would. And uh, But there, right now, i got so many flavors on my mind that uh, I want to revisit 
um, that I don't think I'm gonna buy this today I'm not gonna buy it tomorrow but it's definitely a really really good flavor oh it's gonna be hard to put this down I'm telling you right now fantastic uh, like I've said before with these sweet flavors oftentimes the sugar I, th I think tends to caramelize the wicks and the coil I don't think I care right now because I need to change my wicks and my coil sooner or later so uh, if it runs if I run through this bottle and it gets a little bit too uh, resonated too much uh, carbon buildup I'll do that anyway my only problem with it is that it's 18 milligrams and I have a hard time handling 18 milligrams of nicotine oh man Alpha Vape. Let me tell you the webpage really quick. It's elevated-vaping.myshopify.com. I'll put a link in the description because this is a fantastic flavor. I absolutely love this. I mean, I'm going to enjoy it, and I think I will definitely look forward to buying this flavor again. Not at such a high uh, nicotine content. What are the what are the nicotine options here? Six, twelve, and eighteen. And I don't know. I might. Might hit up. They only have 30 and 120. Hmm. I don't know. I guess I don't know the size. 15. It's got to be 15. That's a 30 milliliter bottle. So, man, I love this flavor. <sighs> One more vape on it. And then I'm going to show you the. Last three flavors I got. I got my sample box coming uh, soon, I suppose. Maybe in the next couple of weeks. So, one more right here. That's delicious. That is going to get refilled as soon as I'm done recording this video. Fantastic. Now, I'm an absolute cheapskate when it comes to smoking, not smoking, vaping e-cigarettes. Because I used to spend a lot of money smoking regular cigarettes, and I don't want to spend that much money. So I have myself on a lot of budget, and I don't buy expensive mods. I don't buy expensive uh, hardware all the time. I'm not that type of person. Um, you know, I buy my fluids, and I vape them, and if I don't like them, I throw them away. And uh, I go back to the flavors I like. So having flavors that I know I can buy again is fantastic. And i got to be honest, that's a really, really cool thing about this uh, Zample box is that I can keep coming back with new flavors. It fits my budget, and uh, I hate raving about products, but here I am. So I like the Zample box mainly just for this right here. There it is. All right, so i got three other flavors to uh, test. i got Calypso. From Lick Brand Vapors, which has been getting one vote, just not enough to win. I got uh, uh, Snake Venom from Seduce Juice. I've opened this. This smells really good. Both of these smell really good. I've opened them when it, when we were doing the uh, sample box unboxing. And then I got uh, Razzle Dazzle from Mount Baker Vapor, which I haven't opened. I have no idea what it smells like. I think it's supposed to smell like, uh, I think it's supposed to be a candy. So it's a, uh, another fruity candy flavor. Uh, now I'll put the list in the, in the description or in the comments. And uh, go ahead and vote for me. Uh, I absolutely I love it when you guys vote for me. Which flavor I'm supposed to review. It's, it's a grab bag for me. It's a surprise. Uh, so I think that's awesome. I gotta take one more rip on this thing, man. This thing is delicious. It really tastes like cookies. It really does. And it's got that nice uh, vanilla wafer. And I swear to God, I'm tasting like a, a thin layer of caramel in there. And the graham cracker popped out at me right away. Now, I don't taste milk. But uh, maybe I could double fist it with uh, some... Uh, uh, Kona 
from uh, uh, Virgin Vapors and get that uh, milk chocolatey milkshake flavor. Fantastic. Love it. Now, if you like this video, go ahead and click like. Uh, feel free to leave me a comment. I honestly try to respond to all of my commenters um, at least once. I try to respond to you at least once in every comment and every video. Um, and if you haven't clicked subscribe, go ahead and click subscribe now. It's really awesome. I looked like uh, yesterday or today. I have over 400 subscribers. That's amazing. I think I have around 418 as I'm recording this. So that's super awesome. I love all of my subscribers. I love y'all. And uh, hopefully I'm doing really good reviews for you, but I'm just doing this for fun, guys. It's just, it's fun for me. So, whatevs. If you don't like it, I'm sorry. But anyway, if you do like it, click like. And until next video.